Hey guys, Rowan here, and welcome back to episode 54 of Ad Lost Words. And as always, Veronica and Eddie, while well, I pointed at them in their proper naming order for a change, are accompanying me for the journey. And uh, I think first thing we're going to do is... You know, what are we going to do? You know... I haven't really thought that much ahead, I guess. You know, I've been checking constantly to see if my, um... My Night Stalkers over by Brock Flower Cave will actually spawn. They won't. Uh, I'm not really sure what the deal is. They, uh... They don't seem to want to spawn. So, uh... Yeah, apparently they've, uh left the game they're not home right now and they will not be back later and do not leave a message after the beep beep so yeah i'm pretty bummed about that i'm not really sure what the dealio is why they uh are refusing to respawn but well can't really do a whole lot about it, I guess. 44 Magnum. Hells to the Yale. But it's unfortunate. I'm not really sure what caused them to not spawn. At least they haven't clipped through the ground or something. But it's uh, unfortunate, upsetting, and I don't like it very much, so... It looks like it's just something I am going to have to deal with right now. I'm not going to restart my game for a vast army of Night Stalkers. Although the thought has crossed my mind. So, if you guys got some encouraging words about my missing knight. Seriously? Kicking cans up. Eddie, was that you? That kicked those cans over? Seriously, there better not have been like a can that rolled down the hill or something. Alright. One second, guys, because um, I'm a little bit paranoid now. A uh, little. Oh. Loading the save game isn't going to do me any good. What the heck? Alright, you guys, you guys stay. Need to check. Need to check this out. Yeah, but as I was saying, um, I really don't like the idea that the cat or cat stores, night stalkers that were over by Brock Flower Cave, and I clearly have them on video attacking me, have never spawned again. I can't seem to figure out why they spawned the first time. I'm pretty sure they should be there. And they're not, no. Um, the, the only thing I can think that might fix them not being there, and I'm not 100% sure if it would even do any good, is to completely uninstall the game, remove all local content, and reinstall the game. Okay, I think there's just two cans that... Yeah. I know, I know. I ran all the way up here to check on two cans. Seriously. What the? I think it's just uh, ambient noise. But, yeah. So, we're missing some Night Stalkers, folks. Like it or not, that's uh, the hand we've been dealt. It's not, um, yes, yes, we see enemies. Which one are you shooting at? Oh. It's not ideal, but, uh, we will survive. And I just got stung, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I did. Fantastic. Because, uh... I was thinking to myself, I haven't been stung by a red scorpion in the last 20 seconds. 
Wouldn't it be fantastic if I got stung by one? And then, you know what, guys? I'm a go-getter. I went and I got stung by a rad scorpion. They said it couldn't be done. Well, I did it, so there you go. No, in all seriousness, um, if you guys got some uh, tidbits of information here for me about my lack of Night Stalker problem, I'm all ears. Uh, oh, by the way, if you've already answered that question, uh, please forgive me. I've been recording, um, basically pre-recording a lot of episodes. So I could actually get more content to you guys at a regular interval. Um, so if, it, if you've already answered that for me, you're like, Oh my God, Ruin, we already took care of that. Why are you asking again? We already told you like seven times the last six episodes you got, you asked. I'm sorry, guys. I, uh, I'm pre-recording. So uh, your comments... Well, they don't fall on deaf ears. I was about to say that, but that's not true. I mean, I'm not listening to your comments. And I am. I love your guys' comments. Keep them coming. Those comments are fantastic, and it keeps me... It keeps encouraging me to keep doing this. Don't you know? Whoa! Nelly, Nelly, Nelly. Hey, now, bird brain. Who do you think you're fooling? I see you hiding there. You were going to try and fly off, weren't you, bird brain? Not so much anymore, huh? Oh, by the way, uh, if you're wondering why I'm moseying on over to Boulder City, it's because I've gotten too close to it. And there's a character who is now going to disappear on a set timer if I did not come over here. Now, I had no intention of coming over to Boulder City right now in the first place, but my hand has been forced. Um, I already experienced this on the PS3 version, so I know exactly what is going to happen if I don't come over here. This gentleman that's over here, he will vamoose from the game. I will become very, very angry. I will rage. I will have to redo tons of stuff. And I will curse... The very day that this guy was added to the game. And we don't want an angry rogue. So, we're going to mosey on over to Boulder City. Shouldn't hurt anything as long as we don't talk to anyone besides our chosen target. So, yeah. And in other words, it'll be fine, yo. What the... What's, uh, what's, uh, happening over here? What's, uh, happening? There's, like, a Brahmin freaking out. Um, whoa. Whoa. Almost walked right into that bird. Did you guys see that? Sneaky, sneaky bird. Thought you could fool me. Well, you had another thing hey, coming. Need anything? Uh, what happened to your bodyguards, dude? You don't have much. Um, okay. Not much of a traveling merchant, in my opinion. Where's all your wares, dude? Go get some wares and come back. I'd be happy to buy stuff from you. Jeez. Disappointment. Anyway. Back to the task at hand. Let's... Let's uh, take a care of this guy, this troublemaker, shall we? Alright. Hey there, soldier. And I apologize in advance for uh, what's about to transpire. Believe me, it's just because of the speech checks. Hi there. You here to pay your respects to? Absolutely. What is this memorial? It commemorates the Battle of Hoover Dam. The Rangers lured the best of Caesar's Legion into Boulder City, then blew the whole town up. The NCR still lost a bunch of troops in the fighting, though. My older brother sacrificed himself so they could evacuate some of the wounded. I'm sorry to hear that. 
Don't worry about it. Well, where are you normally stationed? Camp McCarran, but I'm on leave at the moment. Heading back to California to see my folks. I'm supposed to join up with a caravan that's heading that way up at the 188. But they're not due to arrive for a while yet. Alright, well thanks for the info. Bye. Alright guys. I do sincerely apologize for what I am about to do. Um, I hate to do this. But it's for the speech check, man. The speech check. Uh, my fiance really got mad at me when I did this the first time. I had to explain to her, it's just a game. I'm just doing it for the speech checks. I wouldn't uh, disrespect the military like this in real life. The military deserves our respect and honor because they're, you know, protecting our freedoms. All right. Well, sorry, chap. What the fuck are you doing? My brother died at the Battle of Hoover Dam. You're desecrating a war memorial. I'm sorry, man. Yeah, don't do that. Don't do that. We're going to do and fail the speech check. Sorry, man. I didn't know what I was doing. Yeah, sure. Whatever. I'm done with you. Sorry, dude. All right. We gained some NCR infamy for that. Um, it's such a tiny amount, it's not going to directly affect our stats. See, we're still neutral. And let me show you guys what happens if we shoot it again, which I don't recommend. Hey. Yep. Come on. And I guarantee you we're going to, uh, we're going to lose some reputation for this. I'm not going to participate. We'll see what it... We'll see how much rep I lose. I'm pretty sure that's going to give me a massive amount of infamy. Uh, maybe not. Alright, I guess I can do that freely without gaining any infamy. Maybe that's... Uh, I got shot up there real bad. See... I've got nothing else to say. Alright. Well, alright. I hate to do this then, but... Oh, Alright. Yeah, I'm sorry. Didn't mean it. Don't hate me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. Oh, hey, guys. You guys are supposed to be fighting him. Wait. I didn't shoot. What the... One second. I don't know what happened there. I've got nothing else to say to you. Get him, guys! Get him! Get him! Had enough? Ah. Uh, all right. Well. Oh, wait. That time I gained a ton of NCR infamy. So I thought. I've got nothing else to say. Okay. Your ass is mine. Again, I'm sorry, guys. It's just a game, so don't ha don't get mad at me. All right, didn't lose any NCR infamy for that. Yeah, neutral still. Well, you know what? Actually, I have a I have a better plan. Since that, uh, I've got nothing else to. Say. Yep, we're we're just gonna do it this way. We're gonna be. We're gonna be uh, swift about this. He disappears from the game. That's why I'm doing this. So, if it wasn't for him disappearing from the game, I wouldn't be uh, picking a fight with him. Sorry, man. Wait, why did I get shunned for that? Seriously? Okay. Me. I've got nothing else to say. Yes, I I get that. Ugh. All right. I've got nothing. All right. Look out! Whoop. All right. I shouldn't get NCR infamy for that. Oh, you know what though? 
makes that other NCR soldier over there mad at me. Oh, we can't do that. My bad, G. So, if I shoot this, do I get any NCR... Whoa. Okay. Sorry, guys. We're just, um... Just testing something out here. Okay. Come on, guys. Seriously, guys. Seriously. Come on! Hmm. Alright guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. I had to try and figure out exactly what I was going to do. I've got nothing else to say. And I really think that my best option is to try and blow him up. Oh, let's uh, I've got nothing Yes. Nothing else to uh, assuming I actually can pull this off. And then what we'll do is we'll just leave the area and we'll come back and everything will be forgiven. Oh. I've got Yes, yes, yes. No. Here. Holy say shit. say it to my live dynamite. Because I need those pants exploded anyway. Okay, and that didn't give me lord reputation. And we will have to get out of here. Because now everybody's hostile. Oh! Wait, are you not hostile? That would just be Peachy Keen Jelly Bean if you uh, weren't hostile to me. That would be much, much preferable. Could it be? I don't think this guy's hostile. We've got a situation with Whoa. some great cons right now. The Brass of McCarran has ordered me to lock down the ruins until it's been resolved. Oh, dang it. Goodbye. Well, alright. Where do you think you're going? I can't let you go into the ruins, not without a reason. Alright, well. That's fine. I don't think that that's going to mess up anything. I, uh, I hope. Um. We'll, uh, we'll check in a little bit here. I want to finish, uh, my looting, pillaging, and plundering of this place. Again, guys. <sighs> Sorry, Kowalski. Nothing personal. You're just going to disappear from the game, bro. Yeah, so, well, that's the way the cookie crumbles downstream in a rainstorm. Nothing you can do about it. Sometimes we just got to do stuff for the sake of our uh, challenges and achievements and whatnot. Game's a game. Well, it's just like uh, failing 100 speech checks in the first place. If it wasn't a challenge, I wouldn't be doing it. Because I don't like the idea of failing some. What the heck do we have over here? What's over this hill? Oh, I know what that is. Darn Eddie's detecting everything under the sun here. And it's really starting to freak me out. Yeah, I'm not going to worry about those dots. We should be fine. I think. I think, I think, I think. No. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry for the indecisiveness there. Um, one reason that I'm so indecisive is since I lose some NCR rep. Now, what the heck? 
Eddie, is that you that keeps making that, like, growling noise? That's very bizarre. Um, one reason I'm kind of indecisive right now is we actually do need some negative NCR rep. Um, we are going to need our NCR rep slightly negative for, um, getting some medicine from Ch Ranger Station Charlie, I believe. Now, I've never actually done it, so I can't confirm for 100% certain that it does work. But uh, supposedly, if you uh, get your reputation slightly positive, slightly negative with the NCR, you can't have a strictly negative. It has to be slightly positive, slightly negative. You should be able to get some free meds from them, because they're overstocked. As I said, I've never been able to test it out, unfortunately. Because it's uh, quite tricksy to get your NCR rep balanced that way. But we're, we're going to see how things go. We're going to attempt it. Because I'm nothing if not dedicated to try and plumb the depths of exploration of this game. And we're going to see what comes of it. Mosey on into here. Into Meow. And... Man, that... Sounds like Eddie's making noises, and it's really, really starting to freak me out. Eddie, my man, you... Oh, crud. I just flung a skeleton. Well, I think... I think... I think it's okay. I just hope I didn't knock anything askew. I think we're okay. And I don't think we can pick this up. We're cut off from the rest of the platoon! There's legions all over the place! There's no chance we can get out of here before they blow the town! So we're gonna hold out against them as long as we can! If anyone ever gets this, I'd like to make sure that Private Jeffrey, Huey, and Carapel Marcus Christensen are commended for their valor and sacrifice. Both have upheld the ideals in honor of the new California Republic with distinction. Ranger Teresa Lutz out! Well, that was not a very feminine uh, voice I did there, but, uh, well, Teresa is very manly sounding, alright? Anyways, let's see. I can see the world from here. Um, I don't think there's much here. Yeah, not much at all. All right, and yeah, yeah. There's not a ton to be gotten from this place, but. Certainly enough to warrant the trip to Boulder City here. And let's see, over Mia. Well, I see some red dots. Red dots, red dots. Gotta get those red dots. And... Oh, yep. Uh-huh. And yeah, nice. On the PS3 version, this guy like and all those stuff falls to the ground on me all the time, so I'm pretty much never able to obtain those items. Just wanted to throw that out there. It frustrates me. But you guys know how I feel about unobtainable items. If I know it's there, I want it. Oh, sorry, puppy. Oh, okay, sorry. Alright. Well, they were, they were starving and feral. And we did the, we did the right thing in putting them down. They would have attacked innocent travelers. So, let's see here. I think there's a bunch of random stuffs over here. Yeah. And 
and again, I gotta save because I don't know what's gonna fall through the ground on me. It's like usual, everything likes to fall through the god dang floor on me. And wow, a lot of nice stuff in that bag. I think the loot in that one might be preset. So I, th I seem to recall that you always get like the trail mix. Oh, cigarettes. And there we go. And get all this nice stuff. And wow, we're already on our way to being over encumbered. Did not take long at all. Not at all. I swear, the longer we play, the faster we get encumbered. Oh, I was hoping for a meeting, people. I would have been so happy to see one of those. I desperately, desperately need meeting people magazines. <laughs> Alas, I do not think it is meant to be so. Oh, well. And I think we're okay. Uh, one thing I was trying to, or I'm desperately trying to avoid... Uh, Victor will spawn here and basically greet you, but I think it's after you've already talked to the Great Cons. So I think we're okay still. Oh, let's kill it. Kill it, kill it, kill it. Thank you. Is that the only one? That'd be awesome. I really don't want to get stung today, or tomorrow, or the next day, or potentially ever. Let's just never get stung. That would probably be best. And of course I'm in cupboard. Why wouldn't I be? Because for every 10 seconds I play this game, I have to spend another 9 minutes arranging my inventory so I can pick up more. Then again, you might say, Roan, if you didn't pick up so much, you wouldn't have this problem. And you would probably be right. But, uh, well, let's, let's not split hairs. Um, let's see here. Mm, can I hack this? I think I can if I use a thing, but I don't think I can pick locked safes yet. What did you kick up? What did you do? Well, I I, sh I can't pick locks. I can't pick 75 difficulty saves. Hard locks. Durr. Ah. Oh, well. You guys know what I meant. I think. I hope you guys know what I meant. I'm not crazy. I make sense. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not talking nonsense here, am I? Am I really? Oh. <laughs> yeah, there is really not much to Boulder City, if you can't tell. It's pretty much, that's about the whole town here. We also have this saloon. Which, incidentally, the saloon guy, the shopkeeper or whatever, doesn't always spawn. Okay, he did spawn. That's preferable to him not spawning, by far. Okay. So, since he did spawn, we're going to completely clean him out. And... Seriously, guys! Stop it! Cut it out! Seriously, now? You guys are killing me here. A lot of nice loot to be stolen in here. And a easy lock foot locker. Fantastic. Come on. Easy lock foot locker for Rowan. I said an easy lock foot. Thank you. With nothing in it. Well then. Don't I just feel sheepish? 
Okay. Ah, oh, dang it. All right. Well. Aha! Ah, uh, glare from the lights. Ugh. Ugh, I say. Okay, here. I am so barely able to move right now. Not really. Um, that's what's weighing me down. It's the NCR Ranger thing. Here, take, take it. Take all of it. Take that, take that. Uh, take those. Okay. Alright, let's uh, see if we can't finish pilfering every single thing that isn't bolted down. Uh-huh. I need this guy to, like, go take a nap or something. Got anything? No, not really. No, no, you don't. This place gets a lot more lively later in the game once you've done some of the quests and stuff. Right now, it's, uh, pretty devoid of, uh, any, uh, activity, huh? Kind of the, the saddest bar I've ever seen. Here, you just, uh, you just stay looking that way for all time, chap. Okay? That way, we don't have to have any trouble here. Eddie, I know you're trying to be helpful. I know you know that I need uh, help carrying my stuff. But this particular second, ooh, nickel quartz. What I need you to do is stay out of the way. This guy's probably gonna catch me doing this any second, isn't he? There we go. Alright. Come on. Let's just finish taking all the Elky Hall. Alright. You're gonna have to help out, man. Eddie, I know you like to just sit there and not contribute to the class. But seriously, I need you to carry some of this stuff. Don't drink any of it. Seriously. Seriously, Eddie. I know how you like your booze. But I need you to behave. I don't need you scarfing any of this now. Alright, Eddie. I'm trusting you, Airman. I'm trusting you. Okay. I think Eddie's gonna behave. At least he better. Otherwise, this robot's gonna be sent to the scrapyard. Toot sweet. Yeah. Morning. You think about that, Eddie. Think about what's gonna happen if you, uh, if you misbehave here. Yeah. I'm not sure I'm gonna be able to get this stuff. Oh, no. I'm hidden here. Alright. Fantastic. I'm not sure I'm going to be able to carry everything from here. Considering how many books there are. But we'll try our best. Might take a couple trips. Ah, oh, that's why I saved. Okay. Yeah, that is why I saved. Because you never know when that sort of nonsense is going to happen. Dang it. Oh. That's what happened. I moved too fast. Okay. Whoa. Hitting, like, wrong buttons left and right. You're it's like I've forgotten how to play this. Yes, Veronica. We go over this every single episode. Yes, Veronica. I'm making you carry the heavy stuff. By now, this should be little to no surprise to you. In fact, the, the fact that we keep having this conversation makes me wonder if you pay attention at all. Okay. Stuff fell through, but it fell through in such a way I was able to reclaim it. So I think we're okay on that. 
Okay. Nice little pile of caps there. Somebody must have been playing some kind of gambling game. Okay. Besides, on a side note, all my looting that I do, I think that makes the world look a lot nicer. Not so, uh, not so messy. It's like, uh, you know, uh, Wasteland Cleaning Services right here. Ooh, that was a little dicey right there. That was, uh, Rowan trying to get caught and surprisingly failing at getting caught. Wow, I don't know about this, these items over here. Okay. Let's see. Eddie, you want to scooch just a little bit over? So he stares at you instead of me? Can you see? Yes, you can. All right, hey, Hello. hey, buddy. You know what, Ike? You're a cool guy, but I need you to. You're not gonna turn around, are you? Hmm. Hmm. Ike, Ike, Ike. You dirty scoundrel. You're gonna play it like that, are ya? You're definitely gonna play it like that. You're gonna make me drag these items one at a time to pill for them, aren't you? Aren't you? This is incredibly rude. Jeez Louise. This is not what I had intended to have to do here. Oh, well, when life gives you lemonade, you know, you gotta make some lemons. Alright. I'm pretty sure that's the, the saying. Yep. And then once you have some lemonade and lemons, find the guy who life gave vodka and have a party. Alright. And here we go. Just keep sitting there behaving, sir. As I drag all your worldly possessions over into a nice orderly pile and tidy them up for you. Don't mind if I do. Thank you, sir. It's been a pleasure visiting your fine establishment. You should really decorate the place. It looks kind of empty in here. Anyway, uh, so long, sir. Goodbye. Again, I, I think I mentioned this before. You notice that I'm talking to people a little bit less. It's simply because of getting slightly out of order with places that I need to go. So, it's just a minor, a minor issue right now. We'll, uh, we'll take care of it later. Anyway, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go drop off my stuff in Good Springs. See you guys in just a sec. Hey guys, uh, I realize we're getting close Maybe. to the end of the episode, but I just wanted to show you guys this. Look at this. Stuff in Good Springs has respawned after all this time. It uh, literally only took like, um, I don't know, something like 200 hours. I, I don't know what we're at. Uh, let's let's see we can oh 30 uh, 37 hours excuse me feels like 200 hours to me because you know I'm recording so you know each uh, each like uh, 30 minutes of gameplay is a lot longer than that I'm not gonna record all of me running around here uh, picking the the local produce but I just wanted to show you guys that it was here it has respawned in case any of you weren't aware I'm sure most of you are but you know if you didn't know well there you go it does respawn it just takes a lifetime forever like just absolutely a ridiculous amount of time before anything respawns so 
Who knows? Maybe uh, maybe we'll see some of the mailboxes respawn eventually. Uh, hit me up uh, in the comments if uh, you guys have had the mailboxes respawn after a long time in the game. Because I still haven't seen that happen. Uh, I keep holding out for it to happen, but uh, it hasn't happened yet. I mean, I, every time I walk by these things, I check them, but nothing. I could really, really use some mailboxes respawning. Desperately need a meeting people magazine, but... Well, that's neither here nor there. Anyway, guys, as always, thank you for tuning in. It's been a pleasure yet again. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe because, you know, well, I like it when you guys do so. So, anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for tuning in. So long. And apparently I've lost Eddie and Veronica. I uh, will, uh... We'll have to figure out where they ran off to. But see you guys next time. Bye-bye.